Hello, 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 hello. Oh, this is Jamila Kamara food. Today's menu is fish and dumplings. This actually normally people say is posh people's food, but you can cook this food on budgets. Let me walk you through the recipe. Here I have four type of fishes here. I have salmon, I have um, adduck, um, color adduck. I have another adduck which is not colored. I've got cod, I've got scallops in this bowl. So now I'm going to add milk. I'm going to add next black pepper, white pepper, cinnamon, and allspice, rosemary, fish, uh, maggi, and a little bit of salt, a clove of garlic. I'm going to crush the garlic like this, and I'm going to add a teaspoon of ginger, a two teaspoon of fish sauce. So now I'm going to stir this together so the fish can be marinated properly. I'm going to set this fish aside for 15 minutes. So now, I'm going to show you, show you the mixture of the dumpling. I'm just going to add the Parmesan cheese in the flour. I'm going to add a ricotta of uh, cheese. I'm going to add a little bit of cheddar cheese. A teaspoon of white pepper. A teaspoon of black pepper. I'm going to add three eggs. So now I'm going to mix this together, like this. We don't need no water in here. Yes. So I'm going to add a little bit of salt for taste. When I say a little bit, maybe half a teaspoon. I'm going to set this aside. And put just like this amount of parsley. Make sure that you don't just use the leaf. leaf. You need a stem as well. Because we just need a lot of greenness in this cheesy, creamy dumplings. We need some color. Well now, I'm going to make the wonderful, creamy, cheesy sauce for the fish and the dumpling. I add two tablespoons of olive oil. I'm going to saute these onions, the garlic, the lemongrass, a teaspoon of ginger. You have to keep on stirring. Just saute these onions for only three minutes. No more than three minutes because we don't, I don't want to overcook the onions. I'm going to take them off. I'm going to add the fish and the milk in the pot. So I'm just going to cook this for two minutes. I'm going to cover the pot for this to shimmer for just two minutes. Only two minutes I want this to cook. So I'm going to take this fish off now because we don't want the fish to overcook. I'm going to add one tablespoon of salted butter to the same pot. But this, you have to keep on steady. You don't want this to be lumpy. I add the onions. I'm going to add some milk, like uh, maybe two cups of milk. I'm going to add English mustard, grind ginger, smoked paprika, white pepper, black pepper, two bay leaves, and then stir. I'm going to add cheddar cheese. But I'm going to add all this milk. I marinated the fish in. But I'm going to add a little bit of double cream. Put the sauce into the back. 
I'm going to add a little bit of this sauce in the bottom of this bowl and then I'm going to add the fish. A little bit of parmesan in the top of this fish. Parsley and then spring onion. So now I'm going to add this bad boy, the dumplings, the creamy and cheesy dumpling in the top. I'm going to add the, the cheese sauce on top of this. This delicious dumpling and fish dish is nearly ready, but we are not done yet. So now I'm going to add more parmesan cheese on top and then more cheese. More, the more cheese you put, the more. We need more. We need to enjoy life. We don't eat this every day. Yes. I'm going to put this fish and dumplings dish into the oven now for about 15 minutes. Now the fish and dumpling dish is ready. Now is the taste test. But you cannot cook without tasting. So now I'm going to taste cook to perfection. Cheesy sauce. Delicious, creamy, buttery. Oh my god, that fish just melts into your mouth. The flavors, the spices, the ginger, the garlic. Delicious. Thank you very much. Until next time, see you again. Bye.